got here. Well, hello, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden Sr., and I'm on fire for the Lord. Those of you who are members of the Upper Room, you know what God did on last Sunday. We had an awesome service indeed. The Lord began to move people to the front of the line. And on last Thursday night, when we preached the, well, did the teaching entitled Settled and how the Lord has promised to establish us. God uses, he takes the areas of our lives that are out of, out of order and chaotic and things that are unsettled and bring them together to create a powerful foundation for us and causes us to walk on settled ground and he listen after that you have suffered a while the god of peace make ye perfect strengthen strengthen establish and settle you well tonight we are going to be in that same vein not coming from the same passage of scripture but my 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 it seems to me that we're going to close 2019 Praise the Lord with a bang from the Lord. God is preparing us for the things that are that lie ahead and the things that he are he is about to do in our lives. I'm so excited about it that I can barely hold it and keep it. My words aren't even coming out right today, but I'm excited about what the Lord is doing and what the Lord is going to do. You know, looking back in my life, I I, I see I, I, I can see the hand of God. And, and, and really now I'm giving you a little hint on what we're going to talk about tonight. And I've seen the Lord's faithfulness. And I've seen how the Lord have stood by me. And my friends, he has stood by you. Well, I'm here to tell you that that God who have stood by us on yesteryear, he's alive and well today. He's moving by his spirit and he sees and know every one of us. He knows where we are, he knows what we need, and he knows how to get the job done. So tonight, here I am again, coming to you on this medium to invite you to Bible study. Yes, Bible study. We are going to walk through the pages of the scripture. We're going to see what the Lord is saying, and we're going to walk in the word of God. Now listen, he's a keeper. Yes, he is. It doesn't matter what's going on in this crazy, topsy-turvy world. Jesus Christ gives us stability. Jesus Christ is our helper. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Matter of fact, when David said those things, you do know that uh, those were rhetorical questions. The answer is no one. Nothing. There's nothing to fear and no one to be afraid of because the God of the Bible is in charge. I'll see you tonight here in Bible study. Now, I got to get back to this. Gary, we got to cut this off. We, uh, that, that I've said enough. See you guys tonight. God bless you. Meet me here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. <sighs> Let me get back to this.